Well, Blooms, you've seen some dramatic games in your 10 years here, but that one must take the biscuit. Yeah, that finish was dramatic as, as you'd like. You know, we'd, um, we'd worked our way and, and got ourselves in front and, and thoroughly deserved that, in my opinion, and, and everyone, you know, believes that. And then, you know, for them to get a penalty near the end, I think would have been, uh, you know, rough justice on us. So, you know, I don't think it's too harsh to see that he missed the penalty and, and Matty was a big obstacle in his way and um, we're obviously delighted with the three points. And if you're going to go to the top of the league, what a place to do it on the, uh, the backyard of your local rival. Yeah, yeah, we've had some tough games here over the years. I've experienced some really tough games and, you know, last year we drew here and we were unlucky to lose at home with a, with a great strike near the end with ten men we battled away. So it's lovely to, to go, and get, uh, go and get the three points today and, and come home and, and take us back to the top of the league. And on a personal note, a, personal note, a starting berth for you today in the team, obviously uh, Paris being out of the side, but you've grabbed the chance with both hands and contributed to a, a great performance all round. Yeah, you know, um, it's, it's, been, it's been frustrating, you know, but I've had to be patient and Paris has been playing great, as, as everyone has been playing great. And, um, you know, but I've tried to keep myself as fit as I can. It, it's tough when you're, not, when you're not in the team to keep that match sharpness. You know, I was feeling it the last 10 minutes of the first half, but then second half got my legs back and, you know, I just thoroughly enjoyed being back out there again and it was lovely to be part of a, of a Wickham win. I suppose it's for those lads who haven't been involved, you're looking at those who are in the team and thinking actually, you know, the performance has been so strong that it is going to be difficult to break in. Yeah, of course, you know, and, and you know, the lads have been win, winning games, scoring goals, so it's going to be tough to get yourself in. All you can do is when you get the opportunity is to try and take the chance as much as you can. I'd like to think I've kind of done that today. Um, but next week's another week and, and, and hopefully Paris will be back fit to strengthen us further and, and we'll see what happens. But, you know, it's just nice to enjoy today and... Um, you know, it's just another three points towards where we want to go. You know, we need to try and get to that title and beat last year's title and, and see where it takes us after that. But you know, it's just another three points towards that today. You're given a great ovation by the near 1,700 travelling fans. They're going down the M40, very, very happy. But for you to see that reception from them must have been nice for you. Yeah, it was nice. You know, because you know, we've been through a lot over the 10 years. Uh, you know, the fans have, have always been by my side, and I'd like to think that you know I've done everything I can by then. We, you know, we've been through some good and some bad times, so it was lovely to get that ovation as I come off. I'd given everything, I didn't have much left, and, and the gaffer saw that, so uh, it, was, it was best to put Maxi on for the last 10 minutes, and I thought he did great when he came on, and um, yeah, it was just, just lovely to be a part of that and, and see them. So, you know, they were amazing today, they really did drive us on, you know, second half, we were 1-0 down, and we could hear them the whole game and drove us into that victory, so um, thanks to every one of them for coming in and, and helping us today. And it completes a lovely week for yourself, having passed your UEFA assessment, so all round on and off the pitch, a nice week for Matt Bloomfield. Yeah, it's been a lovely, it's been a busy week, but it's been a lovely week, and uh, you know, hopefully every week can be like this. But you know, uh, you're back to the back to work Monday morning, and, and we'll get going again.